Hey guys, Keldon here, back to show you guys my progress on the provincial building in Fort McMurray. Uh, quick video here, I'm not going to do a, a big, big tour like I did last time. Uh, you guys know what the basic layout is. Uh, show you some of the highlights. Um, I created the, you know, the actual grates here. Um, yeah, I created um, the post boxes. Worked a lot on the buildings and the signage. Um, got these uh, bear-proof garbage cans. I get the double ones with the ashtray, and then there's um, single ones as well. Um, you know, up here and everything. Um, a lot of uh, trees and grass I added. Um, a lot of texturing. Um, a lot of remodeling and uh, figuring things out so that. The area is more fun to skate. You know, lowered more of these ledges uh, to make it a little bit better to skate. Because, um, you know, all this stuff is, uh, yeah, it's way too high to really skate in real life. Um, like, you can, but, um, yeah. Like, who wants to, to try to bust an ollie, like, waist high every time, right? <laughs> when uh, you can... I can just lower the, all the ledges for us to be able to skate way better because yeah in this game you you really can't bust the big ollies the way you uh you can in other games so yeah i did a little bit of work on the nomad inn it's coming along everything still needs a lot of work definitely um the one of the major things i did um this, this area here um, used to just be able to roll right into the garage and uh, I actually uh, changed it so that you, uh, you actually have to go near the door here and then you can press your right bumper to load the garage level it's a separate level you can actually you can actually start in the garage exit the garage and come back here or you can start here and go into the garage it's it's kind of neat kind of neat um, took me uh, a few days to program that because I am not a code guy. Um, had to figure it all out. But yeah, yeah, working on some details. Uh, got some more of the uh, transformers and things like that. Little tiny things like if you can see underneath there is like I bolted that thing to the wall the way it is. And yeah. Spent some time on little details, spent some time working on uh, the buildings and the surrounding area. Uh, one of the things, major things I did, and it, it really caused me problems over the last week, is uh, I added um, all the surrounding uh, distant landscape, because this is a valley, it's down in the, near the mouth of a river. Um, so you can see like trees and stuff uh, surrounding the area, and I added all those, but it caused massive problems with my game and uh, I couldn't compile this level at all. Everything was just crashing, getting blue screens on my computer. But yeah, we got it all sorted out now. I rolled back and got everything sorted out. I should be able to add that stuff again at the very least at the, at the end when I'm nearly done the level. Yeah, we got the cop station over here. That's why there's so many police cars in this parking lot. Um, yeah, not much changed over at the um, Jubilee Plaza. You know, that's a new area. That's everything else is kind of based in the 90s, early 2000s. Um, except for this Jubilee Plaza is a new area in Fort McMurray. Especially this stage, I think, is only maybe a year old in real life. Maybe a little bit more than that. Um, I've never seen it in real life, so I kind of had to eyeball it from the three pictures I could find of it. <laughs> so, yeah, we found two pictures of them building it, one picture from the guy who designed it, and, like, one picture of it completed. But, yeah, that's pretty much for McMurray, you guys. Um, uh... Yeah, I'll definitely come back in a, maybe a month. Uh, it's been about a month since my last video. Um, I'll come back in about another month and show you guys the progress from then. Um, 
Some of the little detail things is I made these little cracks here, um, the bumps that were in the cement. Um, waxed up some of the ledges. I gotta wax up a lot more wedges. Uh, wedges. I gotta wax the wedges. I gotta wax up a lot more ledges, but this was our main skate ledge, so I waxed this and also these two stairs over here. We skated a lot, so I waxed up those as well. Those are my first, first with the waxings. And then I'll do some more as we progress in the level. And yeah, maybe in about a month I'll come back and show you what I've done. Um, I'm pretty sure it's a it's a drastic change since last time. Um, all the the foliage really helps to uh, tie the level together, so to speak, and the lighting. And yeah. So, hope you guys like this video. Um, if you guys want to try this level again, um, you can subscribe to me on Patreon. Um, two bucks, five bucks, whatever you can afford, and you can beta test these levels. Um, yeah. Other than that, you know, thanks a lot for watching, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time.